Hello everyone. Well, in this video, I am going to discuss about how you can handle the keyboard action from Catalan Studio. So assume a scenario where user is typing a text inside the text box by holding the shift key. So hi from. As a result of which, whatever the text user is sending to the text box, it will appear in the uppercase. So let me show you how you can handle such kind of keyboard action where it is required to supply the combination key from the Catalan Studio. So again, to demonstrate that scenario, I'm going to use the demos.telric.com with a text box as a UI component. So inside the test case folder, I will add one more folder called keyboard actions. After that, we need to find the locator of this text box. So this is the locator, which is a text area. So new test object, text area, add ID as an attribute and this is the value. So inside the keyboard action directory, I'm going to add a test case and let me call it as keyboard actions. So the initial step remains same where I'm going to open the browser and navigate to this application. So add open browser then wait for page to load global variable and the timeout property then maximize the browser window after that wait for the text area to be visible And if you remember, when, when we want to supply any text to a text box or a text area, there is a method present that is send keys. So I'm going to use the same keyword or the method for supplying the text to that text area. So add send keys. And this will be text area. So here you need to supply this string which you want to supply to the text area. Now, if I click on the value type, you can see here there's an option called keys. So in the current scenario, what I'm going to do, I'm going to hold the shift key, then supply this string to this comment text area. So if you look at here, in the value type, we have an option keys. Using this, you can simulate the any key which is present on the keyboard. So insert keys. So let us suppose I want to press the shift key. So from the drop down, as you can see here, it has listed on all the keys which are present on the keyboard except the numeric and uh, alphabetic key. So let's say I want to press the shift key. So there is a shift key. And then I need to supply the string. So from the type, either you can select the key or string. So this time I'm going to select the string. And here the value is hi from Rahul. And this value is in the lower case. So let me tell you once again. So in, there is a method called send keys, which can be used to supply the text to the text area. Now input to that particular method can be either a string or you can select the key which you want to supply. So key, and when you select the key, this will provide you the option that which key you want to send along with the string value. So from the type either you can select the key if you are interested in sending any specific keyboard event, or you can select this string if you want to supply a string value. 
so as you can see here automatically it has converted it to a method called keys.cord followed by the shift key and the string value and after that I will delay for two seconds and then close the browser okay so let me run this script so ideally when this send keys method is going to send that text to the text area it should be in uppercase because we are sending the shift key event along with the string so you can see here the string is coming in the uppercase in the similar manner if you want to use any other key you can select from the drop down okay so you have up key up arrow key you have return key that is the enter left control left alt all the function key and so on so in this manner you can handle the keyboard action from the catalon studio that's all for this video and thanks for watching